For our first torque lift test, we wanted to answer the most important question about your truck suspension. Do suspension upgrades actually work? After placing a 2800 pound load over the axle, we tested the suspension of a new Ford F-150 truck under various conditions. We drove the truck through potholes, over speed bumps and around corners at high speed to simulate issues that can occur with a heavy load in the back of your truck, and the results may shock you. We picked six different suspension systems to test against the stable load system. Using an inclinometer, which measures horizontal and vertical tilt, let's see which system has the lowest degree of inclination. Remember, the higher the horizontal and vertical tilt registered on the inclinometer, the less control the driver has over the vehicle. To set a constant baseline, each test was performed using the factory suspension. For the first test, we drove the truck through a huge pothole. The factory suspension was off the charts, registering 151 degrees of inclination. Adding airbags brought it down to just over 62 degrees, but the real winner was the stable load that only registered 30 degrees of inclination. Next, we tested the truck on a speed bump. The rubber springs took last place at nearly 36 degrees of inclination and the sway bar at 31 degrees. But again, the stable load was the clear winner, registering just under 10 degrees. Finally, we took the truck around a corner at high speed. This time, the rubber bump stop came up the highest, registering 36 degrees of inclination. Close behind were the rubber springs at 35 degrees, while the stable load only registered 20 degrees of inclination. So to recap, when driving through a pothole, the stable load was by far the best suspension upgrade. When driving over a speed bump, the stable load was the clear winner. And when driving around a corner at high speeds, the stable load helped the suspension the most. At the beginning of the test, we asked, do suspension upgrades actually work? And we found the answer, yes. The stable load suspension stabilizer not only proved to beat out the alternatives, it is the only suspension system on the market that you can turn off, which means you can easily revert to your truck's factory suspension when not under heavy stress. It is the best and first suspension upgrade you should turn to for your vehicle.